Black Mountain School. We took up the ball field and put a school where the ball field was. Education has its priorities. And the road average. And the, power, <coughs> the old power station is still there. I walked this path for many days going to baseball practice here at the field. Still houses up here, of course, been here for a long time. But one time there used to be some of the nicest houses in the uh, area. camp on the left over here. Of course the hospital is set up here above this little ridge. Hospital curve is what we called it when I was a kid. We were passing official holler up there. Back mountain. Now they've got a horse pen up over here. <laughs> this little area right here used to be our school bus stop. Now they paved it, made it a shortcut going into Black Mountain. Bridge going into number one camp. One time it used to be a wooden bridge till 63 flood, and after 63 flood, they replaced all the bridges. Of course, a lot of the old houses have been torn down, remodeled. I think house 49 might have been up in that way somewhere. Of course, there's a lot of trailers now. Uh, replaced the homes, all the homes, most of the homes have been torn down. Still a few standing. And here's where used to be the old playground over to the left, but there's no more or nothing there anymore. Stepdad lives over there. One of my stepdads is Black Mountain number one camp has changed quite a bit, as you can see. Hope some hope nobody shoots me. <laughs> Taking pictures of their house. That's one of the original camp houses. Yeah. Changed a lot. Mm -hmm. Oh well, that's a stupid way they done this. Yeah. When you get up around the restaurant stop. Doctor's office camp. And this row right here is where I lived as a kid, where where my mother lived, the last house. Of course, the doctor's office he used to sit right there is gone, and so is the old restaurant. Black Mountain in its present day. The porch fell off the post office sometime. I don't know what's wrong with that. I don't know if they're remodeling or thought it was a safety hazard, but it's gone. So was the restaurant. I could could have cried when that went up. You got the foundation. <laughs> yeah, the foundation's still there. My house over there by the creek when I was a kid. 
How many times did, it, did you walk this road? This is my mother's present day house right across from the restaurant. And this is what they call clubhouse camp. That or is where the uh, old theater set. The junkyard is where the old store set. And the, uh, the old gas station. Over here with this store, it says Tiger's Mart. There's the old company building. Of course, the house has been added. And the 30 Temple, that's where the 30 Temple stayed. Well, there's a road going across the creek, that's where the old boarding house used to be. And the building to the left of the bridge, that's where the old drugstore was. To the right, right there, that's where the old gas station was. And the old store. Of course, little store up here is still there which used to be the police station and the boarding house in number two camp of course is uh, still up there one of the few boarding houses remaining Black Mountain just isn't what it used to be More railroad tracks here. And no signs of the temple. This is what remains of the old company building. It's now Tiger's Quick Stop, local food store. That's the side of the old 30 temple. Going up the road is number two camp, which will be going in a minute. And the road out of Black Mountain. There has, has been one improvement. They put them in a little playground and a little park over here, which is real nice. Which of course was occupied the side of the old temple and the old 30 temple, A, B, or whichever one it was, set up there. Black Mountain in its present day. I don't even know if I'm related to anybody down here or not. And this is the way the school looks now after the recent fire. Kind of makes you want to cry, doesn't it? It's been eight years up here. Maybe I'll win the lottery and I'll make it a resort. <laughs> There's nothing left of the little green elementary school. It's gone. So this is a scene I love. I always look out my classroom window and see this mountain. Of course, the little house, the little caretaker's house is gone now. The road up to the school, and there's a graveyard over there somewhere. <laughs> 